Just a few days ago, Lamborghini revealed a new car. It is called the Revuelto, or I think that's how it's pronounced, and it's the next V12 hybrid. And here I'll tell you everything you need to know about this new car. This beast of a car has over 1000 horsepower, 1050 to be exact, and it goes up to 9200 rpm. You get about 725 newton meters of torque and 0 to 60 times of just 2.5 seconds. Also, a top speed of over 350 kilometers an hour. And there is something very special about the hybrid engine, and it is that unlike any other manufacturer, they don't downsize on the engine. It is still a 6.5 liter V12, like in the Aventador, paired with an 8 speed dual clutch transmission. Also, you get 3 electric motors. So, they total out on about 13 different driving modes. This makes this whole car so incredibly versatile. Also, a lot of the car is made of carbon fiber. They made the whole front and the monocoque out of carbon. So, it is super light and stiff. And the way the car is shaped, you get insane aerodynamics. So this car also looks like a goddamn beast. But there is no information about the prices so far. And according to the Stratman, his one will be delivered about the end of 2023. So we still need to wait some time. And there also is absolutely no information about the pricing of this thing. But it will probably be very expensive. In the Lamborghini lineup, this car is of course following the Aventador which has been around since 2012. And even though the Aventador still looks modern in 2023, the Revuelto looks like it's straight from the future. It has the headlights from the Lamborghini Sian and the rear lights from the, from the Cento Centenario. And the rear lights from the Centenario. Why did it take so long to name it? <sighs> and if the future will really look like this thing, I'll be very excited about it. And by the way, if you want a very detailed analysis about this car's design, you should check out the video from the Sketch Monkey. He made a master's degree in car design, so he knows what he's talking about. I mean, I like this video, but you still don't need to watch it, if you don't want to. And there is another very cool thing about this car, and it basically is the configurator. I leave a link to it in the comments, so you can make your own dream version of this car. I mean, probably no one of us could ever afford this thing, but it's still cool to customize a car like that. And I'd like you to comment down below if you like this car or not. I'm really interested in your opinion about this thing, because it definitely looks a little different than other Lambos. I already knew that I would go on this configurator anyway, so I thought, why not share it with you? I just downloaded OBS, it was kind of weird. <laughs> and I'm also using this configurator for the first time. So I, I've seen nothing about it, apart from the video the Stratman did. So this part is also gonna be the first improvised thing on my YouTube channel, and I have no script at all. I guess we're gonna select the car here. Um, okay. Didn't even know there were different options like that. <laughs> oh, we're gonna get this one. Okay. Um, <laughs> base colors. I like blue. And this is fucking gorgeous. Holy shit. Wait, let me get this out of the way. I don't even know what we need anymore. This car has so insanely sharp angles. And it, to be honest guys, it feels like I'm a fucking idiot. I'm sitting on my desk talking to a mic. I don't even know if I'm gonna cut it sooner or later, but... This car is gorgeous. Sportiva Callas. Where's the difference between them? Okay, it's more shiny. I'm thinking push it just to waste some time and make this a little more exciting. I don't know why I like blue Lambos to be honest. Is there like even an ugly color to choose for a Lamborghini? If I'm gonna do it like this, I'm, I don't know, like maybe spending 10 hours on this shit. Pfft. 
I haven't even checked out anything else. Oh. Ah. Okay, let's do it simple. We're gonna take this blue. I, I really like it. That's all I have to say about this. Oh, there's made colors. Ah. Let's make it shiny. Okay, the wheels. I don't know why, but Lamborghini wheels are always nice. They have very modern designs, to say the least. Let's go for bronze. Making it like daily driven exotics. Blue calibers? No? Why? Gonna change it. This looks mean as. I'm gonna say mean as fuck. I mean, who's gonna ban me from the set? Why am I picking blue again? I just said I. It's not a single Lamborghini that is ugly and orange. Mm. <laughs> this reminds me of Andrew Tate's Bugatti, to be honest. <laughs> 